Okay, Danaher, DHR on New York Stock Exchange. Um, we're doing this in a series of uh, COVID-19 ideas. This is the fourth idea of 12. Um, I'm not sure this one actually fits that well with the COVID-19 ideas, but it is a good high quality company and it's a medical devices company. Um, so I think uh, we'll keep it in there. Uh, but there's not a lot of there's not a lot of value in terms of the COVID-19. But we're always recommending companies that are good regardless. Um, and some of these are just sparking our interest to take a look. Like the COVID-19 is sparking our interest to take a second look at these companies. As long as they're good high quality companies and they have a uh, potential to help in the COVID-19 crisis, then that makes it a bonus. But strictly bonus and you should not buy it based solely on the COVID-19 issue. So Danaher is actually not all that heavily involved with COVID-19 at all. It's just a good high quality medical products uh, company, medical devices company. And because uh, it kind of fits in that space, um, we're going to keep it in because it, it is a name you should be owning anyways and it's a really high quality company. All right. so. Having said all that, let's go take a look at the model. We don't even go to their website like we were for some of the other ideas to see what they're doing with COVID-19. They're not really doing anything. They're not heavily involved. Okay, but medical devices company with a great long-term track record. Um, it is a little bit more inconsistent than you might expect, and that's because they've done a, a series of... Um, divestitures and acquisitions and it kind of messes up the accounting a little bit um, it used to be more industrial and healthcare and they've gotten rid of almost all the industrial and then they picked up some other uh, health care uh, so it's it is a bit of a mess okay and you see the invested capital going up and down as well because of those and, and the returns and it's a little bit out of sync nevertheless it's it's a high quality company uh, and now focusing on healthcare medical devices. And you can see it does have a good track record, although, as I mentioned, a little bit inconsistent because of the acquisitions um, or divestitures as well. Um, uh, however, I do think my forecast is a, is a reasonable representation of what I think will unfold in the future, earning about a 20% return. We're going to be conservative and actually fade that over time. And we're just using a plow back, so take whatever cash they earn, plow back that, that plow that back that into the company, and what kind of valuation you get? You get $162 trading at 138, so decent upside there. But we're, I think we're being super conservative. Let's just maybe do a sensitivity on it, and say let's say it consistently earns 20 for the next five years instead of fading. And what do we get there? Sensitivity is important to me. Uh, so yeah, it jumps up to 225. So you can see how just a little bit of a change in an assumption can make a huge difference in value. And that's why, you know, stocks are all over the place. It's one of the reasons anyways, is because they're hard to value. It's hard to say. It's all about the future. Uh, but I think it's safe to say a Danaher is gonna have a good future uh, no matter what. It's been a high quality company for so long. I don't see why that would change now. Um, interesting trading actually let's talk about that a little bit um, um, <clears> that <throat> has barely come off it's only down 5% in one month 9% uh, in the last three months um, I don't know what it is from its peak but that is hardly a move um, and this isn't even involved with COVID-19 so there's no real extra boost uh, by being involved it's just a high quality company it just goes to show you the market will stick with you through thick and thin when um, things get tough. Uh, well, <laughs> thin, I guess, in this case. And uh, just great company. Danaher, DHR. Thanks for watching our investment video. If you want to improve your portfolio returns, simply subscribe. Or if you're an investment advisor or a retail investor and you want help with your portfolio more directly, we can help you with a managed account and manage each and every trade for you.